features She bad, that's a misdemeanor Sick with it, I might catch a fever Hello guys, welcome to Boxing Block Center, the home of Nigerian American Boxing. Please, if you're new to this channel, make sure you click the like and of course the subscriber right now. Well, let's just go straight to it with hesitation. At the end of Matro Boxing, um, stated recently that um, they are trying to steal, salvage uh, and destroy the underwater um, fight. Um, both camps are mentally committed to that fight and um, according to Adriano Matrobo he said both camps mentally committed to the fight I was speaking to Shelly Finko last night we thought the fight was done but if it's not done we would like to save it now a lot of things have been said in the media and we all know that uh, a new head Saudi Arabia has a new head of boxing um, um the last one was not really like uh, like was I don't know what happened but I was like be ousted or has to step aside and Saudi Arabia they trying to build something magnificent and in terms of investing in all sports it's a good listen it's a good way to definitely uh, the more you invest in, invest in boxing or the more you try to um host big boxing huge boxing events in saudi arabia the more attractive it becomes you know because the the place saudi is a, is a holy land you know mecca mecca the city of mecca and i think medina as well uh, but they re they literally hold these fights in different uh, areas, you know, not just um they don't host it in Holy Land, I guess. So we're some parts of uh, other parts of Saudi Arabia. Now, now let's let's talk about this for uh, if it's going to happen or not. I've I've heard rumors. Uh, I've been told by a close member of um, uh, Team Joshua that this fight. Uh, might take place in America as well. Like basically, they are exploring every option. The idea place for this fight to take place is Saudi Arabia. The first fight, the second fight, Africa. This is what uh, Deontay Wilder wants himself. This is what he wants. Um, I don't know, man. Like, I think Team Joshua are, are lacking a little bit. Like they're lacking a bit. Like, like. I don't know man there's something there something is holding them back in terms of they are not as efficient as they were maybe it has to do with the new land, the boxing landscape because I noticed something that ever since Joshua got dethroned um by Ruiz he got his belt back his belts back and then getting dethroned by um Usyk like the every division have literally like it's fall it's falling off so but i know it's beginning to come back a little bit you know joshua is building himself back up but joshua was the back was the is the backbone of every boxing because he took the most risk he fought every upcomer um he fought every contender he didn't dock anybody of course the water fight is the one that should have happened at a time but I think it was a, mi a miscalculation from Team Joshua, basically stalling uh, both Team Joshua and Team Wada both stalled, and just to get the most money out of the fight, which ended up, you know, making um, both lose their titles. And then here we are. The fight is still huge, no doubt. The fight will be watched by millions of people and um it would have been better if both were still champions but i think if the if the zeal is still there um joshua will become a, a three-time world champion i believe that because he's got the tools to do so you know there are some things he needs to work on as defense and his defense has improved but in terms of he fights tentative in a way like he's like scared to get hit and I think he needs to work on that, like because before he wasn't scared, but ever since the real scenario happened, then he Joshua got a little bit like uh, careful. 
and uh, it came became more technical like it's a good thing for a bus to be technical because you need technique to actually stay to actually survive or stay on top um in boxing especially the every division like every division you do need it because you, you if not you become a punching bag you are easily you can easily become a johnny man in the every division if you have no skills or if you rely on your power or just rely on yourself without any implementation of you know or for or of technique or, or any improvement on your technique or any improvement on your defense mechanism or so so um this far right here has to happen um team joshua and team wada tends to be they tend to be ready for it they want it to happen and uh just trying to you know salvage the fight i think is a good uh, step in the right direction now Saudi Arabia right now big events are going there and uh, just was last fight sorry but my have negative things to say but i think he did what he needed to have i literally, literally watched this fight watched the fight back i watched the fight back you know just recently two days ago or so and i began i began to understand what joshua uh wanted to like to how he approached that fight so i think he did well in that fight it's part of the rebuild you know that joshua needs to like needed to take and uh just where still learning it's not really the finished article yet but it's, it's weird to say that because joshua being a two-time ever world champion you expect him to know everything already but boxing in boxing you learn until you retire unless you've been fighting since you was five years old like let me with a let me with a like was born into boxing into boxing family his dad he was a boxer so basically that was easy joshua turned be got into boxing at the age of 18 so it's got a long way to go still but he's a unit he's a machine he's a two-time level world champion in fact joshua has overachieved but i believe personally he's still he's still hungry for more and that's something that is very exciting because joshua is not thinking of retiring now and he wants to become a three-time world champion imagine doing that and maybe uh, the opportunity comes up for him to fight for the speed it i think you put all his all in it you know let's give joshua his, his due credit so guys that's the latest news right here in regards to joshua water fight i can't wait for this fight to happen and uh Saudi Arabia is big fight nights there <clears throat> it's gonna be great Stay with you guys give your thoughts below like the video share subscribe oh.